guys welcome back to my channel let's do aquarius for september 2020 what's coming up for you guys sun moon rising venus solid sun first and the rest this is a general reading take it how it resonates for motivational purposes and guidance for personal readings and more accuracy you can contact me on um, instagram or whatsapp me all right join me on instagram for a free giveaway and other tarot related stuff subscribe to my channel hit the bell icon okay so Aquarius right September 2020 what's coming up Woo. Knight of Cups someone is coming rushing towards you with a love offer all right Aquarius please seven of one someone is going to make the efforts towards you all right they are very willing to make efforts towards you Scorpio Pisces Cancer Aries Sagittarius Leo. <clears throat> the hair font. I feel that this person wants to marry you or this person could be married. But what I feel is that this person is dedicated to being with you or right to get committed to you like that to the level of marriage. I feel that you're rejecting this person. Okay. Someone wants to marry you and you're rejecting this person. But they're still trying this continuously trying maybe you have doubts about this person and you're pretty much happy with your own life and you might be demanding something more out of your life but i feel that there is someone who's interested in you deeply and you're not aware of it so you might be closing yourself off to that person aquarius i feel you're growing and you're focusing on your growth and uh, some of you might be popular people the chariot, I feel that you've decided to move on from something. I feel you've waited for someone from a long time and that patience has actually given you the wings to fly and find someone better or something better in life. And you were doing something to eventually grow yourself and not bother about others. So I feel that you've decided to move on and you're not stopping yourself anywhere for anyone. So I also feel your emotional state of mind is getting better and there is one cancer person who might be interested in you, some of you. Yes, you might be rejecting someone in love. There's a love offer coming around and you're rejecting this person could be a Scorpio Pisces cancer, cancer strongly. All right. So I see this king of wands. So very strongly, I feel this person could be an Aries Sag Leo and you're rejecting this person and they're feeling sad because you're not interested in them. That's how they are feeling. This person could be very attractive. They feel like you threw their offer away in trash and they feel hurt. They feel backstabbed. You might have done something right, but you kind of hurt them unknowingly. They feel hurt, they feel dropped or pinned down by you, okay? And they're not liking it, they're, their ego is hurt. This person could be a Gemini or a Libra Aquarius as well. Aquarius, but I feel that now this person is feeling anxious and now they are, they've built up walls around you and they feel that you might hurt them, okay? They are feeling very cautious these days, but they still want you, okay? But they're not very consistent with the offer. They're coming and going. They're coming and going. And this might give you a kind of a aura or an energy that this person might be a player. But they're just protecting their heart and protecting their ego. That's it. I, I sense ego more than heart. So <clears throat> I feel that you're not chasing this person anymore. And that is why this person wants to make a move towards you, Aquarius. Yes, it's like a... It's like efforts for them. It's like work for this, for this person. So, yeah, now they feel strongly about you, you know. But now they're being more protective of themselves. They are take, they're being very careful while they're taking a step towards you. They're not being very consistent or very open about their emotions, but they're working on it. Like working on to, you know, revive this connection or develop those feelings in you. Scorpio Pisces Cancer, this person could be... Yeah, Empress, I feel that this person sees you as someone who's very stable entrepreneur or uh, who has her or his own life balanced. Very stable energy they see you as. You might be having cancer in your chart strongly. 
this person wants to date you wants to marry you and they also see that you're you're not going to you're going to you're not going to settle for anything less and they see that they might not be as worthy of you as you are for yourself they see you as someone who's beyond their level beyond their match and this is making them crazy i feel that they're working even harder to get to your status this is how they think you know but the status doesn't uh work in relationships but they are very bothered like that i feel they're feeling left out in the cold by you and they're seeing that you're doing well in life even though they're not in your life they see that how happy and growing you are and uh, building finances building growth popularity and they're still in their old zone could be a virgo that you might be dealing with so this is bothering them okay they're seeing you grow and this is bothering them even more eight of wands so this is making them crazy i feel that they're crushing on you even more they're attracted to you even more like not uh, like they were not attracted to you that much before but now they are very much so there's a huge sense of attraction coming up from this person you might not know but they are trying to hold on to their attraction so that you don't come to know and this is making them feel insecure So I feel that you guys might be working together. Scorpio, this person could be a Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn as well. There is a work relationship, and you might be working in a place where there are other people involved, and so that is why you guys are keeping yourself a distance with each other. All right. <coughs> Excuse me. Yes. Yeah, so I feel that there there is a third party who tried to break this connection. you know there was a third party i feel the third party could be at your workplace who tried to break this connection and this is the reason why or someone new came into your life and this person was out of the game out of the picture and now this person is feeling sad you know what aquarius doesn't matter how this person feels you need to be with the right person that's it the crux of the matter three of swords very clearly i feel that there was an entry of a leo or there was an entry of a new person who like made you feel happy unlike this person who made you feel good okay okay i feel that this person hurt you in the past the leo person maybe <coughs> sorry excuse me the leo person kind of hurt you in the past and uh, you thought this person is the one but i feel that this person could actually turn into be the one if you guys heal your issues yeah i feel that this person might be having some personal childhood issues that they need to heal before they can heal this relationship you need to actually open up your heart to this person or let this person open up their heart to you that would be easier for them or for you to let each other in in this connection spiritually so this is a soulmate that you're dealing with but the soulmate is going through a lot of personal struggle in their life i feel that aquarius your personal life is very abundant or you're heading towards abundance sort of money coming in soulmate coming in a lot of heart to heart conversations coming in someone from the past coming back within the next few months this is going to happen i feel that a romantic situation is going to develop within few months Let me check more Aquarius, please. So you're going to get abundant. Maybe this month or next month. So don't worry. You, as I told you, there's some Cancer person around you who loves you. Okay. So I feel that the people around you are safe, and you will always be loved. And people around I uh, around you are loving. You just need to adjust to certain situations with people. bring love into the situation i feel that aquarius you need to be more loving towards people around you okay because this might enhance the aura around you and this is going to in, in turn help you only what is that last piece of advice for aquarius for the month of september 2020 okay hello <laughs> aquarius please 
progress so i think you're trying to perfect things you're trying to make things perfect otherwise you leave that thing i think you need to focus on progressing not perfection healthy communication if you want to build a communication with someone keep it healthy have healthy give and take heart to heart discussions is very important if you want to connect build a connection with someone okay so writing some of you are interested in writing what this person is that might help you or this person heal so you can guide this person if you, if they are not healing right now so i feel that there's going to be a lot of heart your opening of heart is going to take place in uh, september you're going to unlock your heart heart chakra okay failure yeah, there are some failures but i feel that you need to look past the failure and the honesty and forgiveness will help this situation get better okay so let's see what all signs are coming towards my aquarians for september 2020 signs which are going to come to aquarius leo so there is this leo person interested in you with whom the failure happened they might come for forgiveness they might be honest this time to you and you might open up your heart to this person some of you might deal with a taurus some of you might deal with uh, another taurus yeah there's a strong taurus energy someone taurus is interested in you virgo so yeah someone is a virgo okay you might deal with an aries person or a sagittarius person so these are the signs that you might be dealing with aquarius so i hope you have liked this reading and if you did don't forget to like this video subscribe to my channel hit the bell icon mention in the comment section share this video till then we'll see you next time bye bye